Coach, can you talk about your assessment as 23 turnovers tonight led to 20 of their points? That was it. You just hit it on the head. That was the number I wrote on the board for the guys after the game. Uh, just some, some really um, forced plays, careless plays. Um, you just can't give the ball away 23 times and, and think you're going to win. Sorry. Um, what do you see from from Dennis Smith, coach? He was, I mean, he was okay at spurts, but I thought uh, I just went for the gamble and just because Mud started getting it going, and I just rolled with it. And I thought Zoe was playing well, uh, so I just rolled with it. But uh, you know, he had seven assists. Uh, he made some plays for other guys. I thought, uh, uh, you know, obviously a couple of his turnovers was was uh, was um, you know that hurt us a little bit, but. You know, at the end of the game, it wasn't much about any of that. I just saw that mud started getting it going and just thought I'd roll the dice to try to get it. Coach, uh, Dotson had a great first quarter, put up 18 points, but then kind of faded the rest of the game. Yeah. Did you see anything from Minnesota that took him out of his game, or was it something else? Uh, I do else think maybe? they put a, a definitely more focus on him. They started topping him on the baseline where they wouldn't let him come off screens. Uh, they really wasn't allowing a lot of separation. Um, they were stunting off of our point guards to get to them, um, you know. So they definitely uh, did some different things. They started switching any kind of pick he came off of, so he couldn't get a clean look. Um, but overall, I thought he played a, a, a solid basketball game all the way around. Coach, um, I was going to ask if uh, you thought that the fact that you hadn't played in a while was there a point that maybe a little rust and to get going or I don't know I think but we all kind of are in that boat right now you know uh coming off a break and um you know but it was definitely something there because our, our timing on our passes and some of our turnovers were just you know just wild um and, and our focus defensively on on just guarding guys from a, uh, the standpoint of awareness um uh, staying down on shot fakes. We went up. We went up for over. I guarantee you, it was ten plus times we went up for a shot fake, and that was just a lack of focus. And uh, those are things that we can control. Coach, oh, another question is: uh, Is it tough sometimes to balance? I know you want to kind of play the guys and give you know give them the experience, but then you keep someone like Jordan in for thirty three or thirty four minutes. He's obviously a great player. Right. How do you juggle that between well, what I you want to? do for the long run yeah I think sometimes though it depends on how the guys are messing up the young guys are messing up if their mistakes are mistakes that I gotta show more discipline about then the vets are gonna play more in that situation um, you know this was one of Mitchell's uh, you know uh, one of his uh, not so good games um, he still had three blocks but um, just from a, a focus standpoint and just really being locked in this wasn't one of his better games and hell DJ had you know 16 and 19 tonight, so I wanted to keep him going with that. Uh, I didn't get anything yet. I haven't talked to the doctors at all. Uh, 